Good morning and welcome to TransWest Truck Trailer RV of Frederick. My name is Callie Say and I'm here at TransWest in Horse Trailer Sales. So for those of you that aren't familiar with us, we are located right off I-25, about 30 minutes north of Denver. We have Cimarron and Logan trailers, so if you're looking for a brand new trailer, those are the two options that we carry. If you're looking for something used, we have a large variety of used trailers that we either buy outright or take in on trade. So what I've got right behind me today is a brand new 2023 Logan Riot two horse bumper pull warm blood. So for those of you that have some extra large horses or horses that you want to ride on a straight load, this is a really great option for you. It is a brand new trailer, so it does come with manufacturer warranties of eight year structural, two year hitch to bumper, and a lifetime warranty against any structural corrosion. I always like to throw that last one in there because a lot of people are like structural corrosion. This is a galvanized steel frame trailer with aluminum sheeting. And what that means is it is a galvanized steel, not black steel. So you are not gonna have the issues with rust and corrosion that you would on a black steel trailer. The galvanized steel gives the trailer added strength without having those issues of rust. Anywhere they do have galvanized steel, you're gonna see a vortex lining on it. Vortex lining is very similar to what you have on your truck beds. It's, a, it's almost like a bed liner and it's gonna help protect all of that galvanized steel. It's gonna keep this area, especially where you get a lot of gravel and road blast back here, it's gonna keep it looking a lot nicer and cleaner for years and years to come. We've got on this bumper pull, this little pink tag here. A lot of people that are walking through our lots, they always wonder why we've got so many things pink tagged. Every single trailer, new or used, will be run through our shops when they arrive. So we do a multi-point inspection on every new trailer that comes in. That's something different than what most dealerships do. A lot of dealerships just bring in trailers. They, they, you know, they just go off of what the manufacturer inspected by um, and they wash them, put them on the lot. The thing with having these new trailers come in with our full service shop is we're able to go through and take care of any warranty issues right away so that when you pull this trailer home, you're not gonna have to get home. And if there was something that was missed at the factory, We've already taken care of it. You don't have to deal with the hassle of submitting for warranty, bring it back into a service repair shop. It's just one step that makes your life a lot easier and makes our new trailers truly the best new trailers out there. Every single one of our used trailers also runs through our shops and on all of our used trailers, they'll do alignments, they'll check brakes, repack bearings, go through all the lights. So they go above and beyond the safety inspections that are required which means that our used trailers are gonna be a step above everybody else's. On this particular trailer, we've got diamond plate on that front nose here. And that's gonna just take a lot more abuse than these 050 aluminum sheets above. So these sheets here, we have a lot of hail that comes through and they're a lot stronger than what you'll see on a lot of the roof sheets. But this right here, where you get most of your gravel fly up, it needs a little bit more protection and that's just gonna keep your trailer looking a lot better for a lot of years to come. It's gonna make it easier for you to resell. Nobody wants to, to pull a trailer around that has a bunch of gravel pits on it. On your Logans, you have tons of different color options. If you pan over there, you can see that we've got white, dark gray. We can get them in a, a, a tan. We try and carry a variety of colors and for the Logans, almost every single one of their colors that they have is not an upcharge. So Logan has three different models. They have the Crossfire, which is kind of your bare bones entry level trailer. And we'll sometimes carry one or two of those. We have a used one right now. Then you'll see us carry a lot of their bullseye options. And that's where they've gone in and added some custom features like the actual built out door versus a prefab door you know, upgraded drop downs. Uh, you've got your sides are corrugated, your upgraded dividers. So there's a lot of cool options that they do on their bullseye models. And then one step above that is your Riot trailers. And your Riot trailers, you can really do whatever you want on. They're their custom models. And so a lot of times we'll order these warm bloods in the Riot model because we can go in and throw in a few more extras that we really like and a lot of customers find a lot of value in.
So let's work our way around to the pack room here and kind of walk through some of the things we did in here. So on this particular trailer, you've got the, the saddle racks in the back there. Uh, you can take those in and out. So if you just run with show boxes, it's really easy just to put your tack trunks in there and have all that additional space. These come with these drive over wheel chocks here. So if you ever did have a flat, it's really easy just to drive right up on that. You don't have to worry about carrying a jack for your trailer. This is gonna be a great little option for you. I have a lot of people that, oh, they love this option when it comes on there. They're so excited about that drive over, over wheel chalk there. On your door, you've got your four tier swing out blanket bar with the brush box below. And we've got a nice little window there. So if you've just come from a trail ride or a show and you're your blankets are hanging right here. They're gonna get some nice airflow and hopefully dry out on your way home so that you don't get that musty smell in your trailer. On the inside, you can kind of see that framing here of that galvanized steel. Um, it's just gonna hold up a lot better to a lot of the wear and tear vibration on the road. Galvanized steel, steel pound for pound is very strong. LED lights in this one, you've got two in the tack room. So those are on individual switches as well as a master switch. It's gonna make it so this is nice and bright in here at night. So if you're using your trailer um, at a show that runs a little bit late, you're gonna have the ability to see what you're doing without having to walk around with a flashlight. You've got 12, row, 12 bridle hooks up above with carpeting behind. Carpeting's gonna keep it a lot quieter on the other side for your horses. And um, it's gonna uh, just keep this wall a lot nicer. You've, spend a lot of money on your head stalls and bits, so I want to keep those nice and protected. And then we've got a water hose here. There is a water tank that comes with this trailer. We're just waiting on it. So once we have that in, this will also have a square water tank in it. On these rides, we do escape doors on either side. You've got drop downs with the window screens on them. These jail bars, if you're just wanting to throw some feed for the horses, Really easy just to toss them in. We've got some nice big feed bags on the inside there. So gives you some flexibility as you're traveling down the road. This trailer is running on two 3,500 pound rubber torsion axles. So plenty of axle underneath this trailer. We did go and upgrade two aluminum wheels on this. I think it's a really nice little trailer. There was no reason to have steel wheels on it. These aluminums are gonna look a lot better. They're going to weather, weather the test of time a little bit better than those steel wheels. On each side of the trailer, you've got these little eight inch awning lights. So on the rear and on each side, it's going to make it just so that if you are tacking up at night or using your trailer at night, you can get some, get some light shed on those horses and kind of see what you're doing. Nobody wants to drop a, drop a hoof pick and not be able to find it at night. I talked about one of the upgrades on these riots being these extruded sides. We do corrugated sides on the bullseyes and these extruded sides are just so much stronger than, than that corrugated. The corrugated gives it a nice look, but structurally this actually helps um, some, with some of the, uh, the forces that those sidewalls get on the trailer. So you're adding strength by having these nice extruded sides here. Another upgrade that we did on this particular unit is we wanted butterfly latches wrap around on this one so that instead of just a hold back for these for these curtains, curtain windows here, you can actually have a butterfly latch so you can securely attach it to the side of the trailer. That way, if you do want to run with them open, a lot of people that have the Dutch doors with rear ramp, they want to be able to wrap these curtain windows around, latch them to the side and get a ton of airflow moving for, through those trailers for the horses. So. Just a nice little upgrade. I think that nobody is gonna be upset that we have this style on there. So as we work our way around here, this is where a lot of people kind of lose their minds on these Logans. They absolutely love these floors that Logan has. So Logan has what's called a whiz-proof floor with sure grip. And if you walk right around here, you'll kind of see they do on the windows, they do kind of a example of what that looks like. So it's a permanent floor that they put in. It has, it has the ability to drain. And 
Anytime we have a drainable floor, we want to make sure that there's not urine sitting on the floor, trapped, unable to get out of the trailer. And Logan has this really ingenious design where they've got these aluminum slats that are coated in that vortex lining, so that bed liner. And these slats have these, these areas where the urine can just drain right out. So you don't ever have to worry about that urine sitting on your aluminum floors. So really easy. I can throw a bucket of five gallon bucket of water on these trailers and within seconds that water has drained out of these trailers. So it's really quick to use. A lot of people don't even run with shavings on these. Um, so it's a lot easier to clean. They've done some studies where they find that Horses are actually a little more sure-footed on this, this type of floor because they don't have mats slipping underneath them. So it's got a lot more texture and grip to it. If you do have a horse that paws and is shod, you know, if, if you have one that really wants to work at it, over time they can feel up a little bit of this sure grip. The nice thing is Logan can send you a patch kit and it adheres really well to itself. So you don't ever have to worry about having a hole in the sure grip flooring. Way easier than mats, just hose it down when you're done with it. Uh, the, the air coming up through the trailer kind of helps keep those horses a little bit cooler because you do have that slats and the floor is breathable. As well as if you've got uh, manure sitting on this, on this floor, it's gonna help dry out that manure and it's gonna make it really easy to muck out when you get to your destination. So really great little option on the floor here. This rubber ramp here has a really great texture to it and they have these bars underneath that helps that if, even if it is a little bit slippery, it gives these horses something to kind of grab onto. So I'm a really big fan of these Logan ramps here. You've got butt bars that are padded and we here at TransWest have always really loved the padding on Logan's butt and chest bars. It's completely sealed, you don't have to worry about it sliding and slipping on and it's a really heavy duty material so we've we've always been a really big fan of those over the hip side you do have these huge bus windows padding all around you'll see more of that vortex lining and if you've got a kicker these do hold up really well to those kickers and here you've got uh, roof vents over each stall and if you ever had to you can take this entire assembly out and have one big box stall. So it really gives you a lot of flexibility. One of the things we talked about was, you know, kind of the buzzword here is warm blood size trailer. This is a 7'6 tall, 6'10 wide. So it's gonna be plenty of height to load those big horses in and out of this trailer. I think anytime you've got a horse that doesn't fit in a trailer, this is gonna be a really great option for you. So as we work our way around, you'll kind of see more of the same from the other side. You know, wraparound windows here, and those do have bus windows on them as well. So if you are traveling in the winter and maybe don't need quite as much airflow, but you still want to keep some, some movement back there, you can crack those windows open on the rear and still get some airflow. Or if you're using it as a box stall, it's a really great option as well. Here's a better example of that escape door, how wide open it is. These feed bags are just clipped in, so if you need to, you can take them out, rinse them out, um, just make your life really easy to use. You're always welcome to hang hay bags too. They've got clips for hay bags or ties up above in the, in the horse area. And then because you are just a standard width on this trailer, you do have running boards all the way along, so it makes it really easy to get in and out of this trailer. Gives you a little bit of purchase for your feet to get in and out. So if you guys do have any questions on this trailer or any of the trailers we have coming in, I would love to answer them. This particular trailer you can find on our website. It's 5N230418. It's a 2023 Logan Coach Riot two horse bumper pull. Remember it is warm blood size. So if you're looking for a bigger trailer, really great option. You can contact me. My name is Callie Say. My phone number is 970-309-6368. If this trailer is close, but not quite, we can always custom build you one with whatever modifications you want to make to this particular unit. Or, you know, if there's just some small things like adding electric jack or more tie rings, that's something that our shop does all the time. And we would be happy to accommodate for you here at TransWest. So really appreciate everybody taking the time to tune in today. I hope everybody has a really great Memorial Day weekend. 
Thank you so much.